Well, hello, Shirley Rocks here. Welcome back to Planet Crafter. Oh, I'm so excited. Um, the, they're doing the DLC for this game. It's uh, going to be called The Planet Humble. It's coming soon, so I don't know when. But just take a little sneaky peek look at this. So it's only like 40 seconds. So it looks like there's a whole new... It, that's proper Subnautica vibes, that. That's like a... I see there's water, there's an underground tree, there's there's bases up in the corners there. That looks like a hole. It looks like we can that looks like wait, 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 go back a second. Right, so let's look at this. Pause, 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 pause. So that looks very watery. That yeah, so no, 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 that's that's uh, the grass spreader, isn't it? I think. I don't know what that is. It's animated, though. It, it, is, it, is it a water fountain? But there's all stuff over to the right as well. Yes, look, that's all water. That's the, uh, the new thing I'm about to show you in the video. So, and there's like a... a, a um, Methane-y, uh, must, mustard gassy. Okay, this does look good. I see. Yes, yes, lava. Okay, so that's coming out soon. Don't know when. But anyway, let's get back to the video. Okay, back in the room. So that's coming out soon. So don't forget to wish list that because that's going to be good. Now, I want to play a little bit more of this. I've been, been struggling to... How do I word it? I've been struggling to do the content on this because I am still really newbie both at the game and at the level in the game so I've got a lot of catching up to do so I've been doing some little bits but not a huge amount so I have I've left the other biodome there but now I have to go in from up there so I need to, I probably need to put the stairs back in yeah I, I ain't got stairs at the moment um have I actually got anything to put a door in no Iron titanium and something else. Yeah, so we need to sort that out. Um, I think it was silicon. Yeah, because it's it's not ideal, but at least we can get in it if we do, <laughs> if we do that. We can get in it because I've got yeah I've got that, and I'm collecting wood from there. I've got my recipes. We did have. A new email to read as well. Uh, we had a new message from Riley uh, reporting about strange signatures, and that's at minus 248, 42, 93. Um, I'm at 969 at the moment, but I think I'm going to build the base up a little bit first. Um, what I've actually done to the base with my madness since you've all last watched. Um, I've not really done much with the growing. I have been my well not mining collecting all these um i need to expand this properly i've built, built another little spur room in here i might actually move all these over i'm actually full of food at the moment so let's see if i actually got enough to build no oh, it's always the stuff that i need that i'm always short of like you know i just need three iron to do a cupboard and have I got three iron? No. I do need to have a little drink. Okay, so let's go and quickly put a cupboard in uh, locker storage in here. I'll put a couple in here. I've not decided what this room's going to be yet, but it'd be good to get some extra storage because I has loads of stuff. So let's put some food in there. Okay, food. Actually, speaking of food, I need food. Right, so, um, so we've, we've expanded that a little bit. I have some big, massive, big drilly thing here. That's boosted up my heat. We are currently, I think we're looking towards getting trees next. Yeah, we're on floor at the moment. Mm, quite happy with all that at the moment. We've not got anything really tech as I need to build at the moment, although I have not got a tech. Let me see. Can I build it in here? Oh, it's here. 
yeah, Tech 2 craft stations. Um, I can do Tech 3 agility boots now, which will make me run a little bit faster. I don't think I've got those at the moment. No, I've not. And also, I, I want to get the Tech 3 exoskeleton, because it means I can carry more. So for that, I need Osmium, Osmium, Super Alloy, Uranium. Now, I have got a little bit of progress with both of those, so let me do my... I might be able to build this off the bat. So, what did I need? I need uranium rod. Yes. Osmium, osmium. Super alloy. Oh, yeah. It's always a super alloy I never have enough of. A super alloy rod is loads of super alloy and magnesium. So, let's just make a little bit of super alloy. We're just going to get random bits of stuff. I, I literally can't remember the recipe, but it's probably some of them things make super alloy. Probably need magnesium, uh, aluminium as well. So let's grab a load of that. Okay, can I make... No, I've not got silicon. Uh, um, get rid of that. Have I got silicon anywhere? I don't think I have. That's more food. I love how I just put the cupboards with no names on them, and I'm like, where's the silicon shells? Now, I have actually got, I've got a bit of a silicon stash, which I could go and raid. Right, yeah, let's go and, let's go and empty me pockets, because I have got some stuff in here. I want to empty some of this out. I'm just, got, yeah, I'm being, being really lazy. Really, really lazy shells. I want to show you what I've been, I've been doing some OCD levels of, um, organising. So, my first cave over here. So I've been mining the um, the, the the red stuff. The name uh, forget it. I uh, forget the <laughs> name the name of the stuff at the moment. What's it called? Got osmium in my head. It's not osmium. Anyway, let's call it the red candy. So I've been I've been mining the red candy in here, and. It's random if it spawns, so what I'm having to do is come up here, open this, Erdi Iridium or Erdium. So I've been doing that, emptying that, and then coming in here, and <laughs> I've got I've got new levels of organisations. Uh, what was in the tick cupboard? Oh, titanium. Okay, um, cobalt, yeah. Magnesium, uh, silicon, yeah, I think I needed some of that. Let's take a bit of that. Iron, I have silly amounts of. Cobalt. I can't remember if I needed cobalt to make super alloy. I think we probably did. So we'll take some of that. I think I've got loads of titanium at like just hanging around. So I'm just having to keep doing it doing this. There we go. Finally got a piece. Um and I've done another I think I've got another cupboard up near the Osmium mine that is similar similar like that. So that's one of the things I've been uh, grinding away doing. Um, I want to get this new thing, and then we're going to talk about the new thing, the new exciting thing. There is a new, well, I'd say new, it's new to me. I've not seen it yet. I'm refusing to watch anyone else unlocking this or using it because I don't want to spoil it for myself. Let's grab all that. Okay, so I want to make some of that. I need magnesium and that now, so let's see. I've got enough to make a few of these now. Let's grab a load of that. Okay. Make it. Make it. Make it. Okay, I'm out of titanium. I did say, oh yeah, I've got loads of titanium. I don't need titanium. I, apparently I do. Okay, I've run out of iron. Have I got enough to make that yet? No, I need one more piece. Right. You think iron? I've, I've actually got iron just thrown outside. I think. No, I haven't. So it's all titanium and magnesium. I'm pretty sure one of my cupboards has a cheeky bit. Yeah, there's a cheeky bit there. Okay. And magnesium, maybe. Oh. There's nothing like not preparing any of your stuff for the video and then finding that you need loads of it. Right, are we ready to build now, Shells? Are you sure you're ready? 
Okay, so let's build that now. Right, I needed that, that, and I think that's it. Right, so all of that is to build this, which is the Tech 3 Exoskeleton, which increases my equipment storage. Equipment storage is these like slots. So currently I have uh, 12. So let's build that. Nice, I have an extra slot now so I can carry even more stuff. So that means I could then go and get like, what have I got? I've got Tech 3, I've got a Tech 5 backpack. Let's see, was that, do we build that in here? Yeah, we did. Um, Tech 1 jetpack, boo. Tech 4, yeah, no, no, we've got all of that. It's the running boots is probably the, uh, the best thing I wanted to do. I need two super alloy and explosive powder. It doesn't, the, these things are good to do, but they're still, they're like, um, how do I describe it? They're like, it's negligible if you notice it. And there's much better things you could be spending your spondulies on, like this. Right, vehicle station. So, apparently I can create a vehicle. I need things though. I need more super alloy, so I need two more lumps of that. Hopefully I have not just wasted it all making my magical carrying things. Did I have any spur? No. Right. What I'm going to do now is I am going to go on a journey and I'm not going to show you where I'm going. Not that it's secret, but that it's really boring watching me run from one place to another for 10 minutes. We are going roughly over there. Oh, that, that reminds me. I need, I've been playing with my graphics turned right down simply because, where is my graphics gone? Uh, medium. Yeah, I've been, t I've been, t I've been turning my graphics right down simply because um, it absolutely canes my GPU if I put this on really high. You won't notice that, but you'll notice the difference between, look, that's very high and you can't see the, the thing. And if I turn it down to medium, Look, you can just you can see that bit, you couldn't see the other bit. I'll show you again. This is my best video ever. There you go. Right, so I'm going over there to the mine. Be back soon. Okay, we're coming up on the ship now. This is where my mine is. So let's get my oxygen back up. We've got a few little bits in there. For some reason I've got a golden effigy and I've got a little buildy thing and I've got some eggplant seeds. Or as I like to call them, aubergine. Right. So this is where my osmium mine is. And this is where I've been mining stuff. So if I go to disassemble, you can see this is actually a tech two ore extractor, which means now this can get me lovely osmium, which is lovely. That is just what we need. And that is just inside there. And we also have one mining super alloy. now. It will get super alloy, it will get other stuff. So it will might take a while to get the other stuff. I don't really want to take all this with me, so I'm going to empty all that out. And the destination for this one, if you have seen the previous series I've done with this, to find the the next mine, we go over this way to the desert, desert area. But I just want to show you something in the water. Now, this is the original location where my pod was. But, I don't remember this game looking this good previously when I played this underwater bit. Now look under here, look. So whether it's because it's developed, look, there's like these massive things. The rocks, look, there's my old little pod. And there's, there's stuff everywhere. There's all bits of rocks, loads of coral and stuff. How cool is that? Anyway, that is, okay, what is in that? Okay, that's obviously a chest I've just chose to ignore. <laughs> There's nothing exciting in that. Silly shells. Anyway, I'm going to go to my super secret mine, which is uh, over this way, I think. Yeah. Yeah, we go over this way. We'll be at it soon. It's nice as you're flying towards it as well, the graphics on full, because look, you can see in the distance, look, there's like waterfalls over there. And another area. I'm not sure if I've ever explored that area. But... The planet is slowly becoming more and more terraformed, and it's 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 really cool to see the difference. Now we are heading now over there. 
Whereas a little gap, as you can see, I've done a midway point because I have died multiple times. There's nothing really worth me looting in there. So onwards towards that bit where the vertical columns are. Okay, so we're heading inside now. This is where you need a torch because it's dark, but as soon as you go inside, it goes bright yellow, so you can see. Right, so this is where I'm getting my super alloys. So look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten super alloy. Now, I can get rid of all that. And if I really wanted to empty it out properly, I could just do this. But I reckon long term that might have problems with the game engine. That if I just, if I'm just dumping stuff on the floor, if it's if it's tracking it. So I'd be interested to know if anyone has done mining like this, and if long term that has a negative effect. Because I'm wondering if it does. Um, I'm just wondering that energy reading we saw before in the email. Is it in here? Because I remember there was something to do with these doors, but. I think it might is it later on yeah I've I've opened them doors I can't remember how I did it but I've opened them anyway back home I go okay back home I've took my shoes off empty my pockets and now we are ready to try and build this so this is a vehicle station not a clue how it works if it's gonna suck all my power or if it's gonna cause me pain so we're producing one and a half thousand well, 1,589 energy, consuming 1,400. Now, it does say that uses minus 63, which doesn't seem to be an awful lot, does it? I think we should be okay. Right, so let's try and build this. Now, I'm going to be whizzing in and out all the time, so I think we should probably build it somewhere like out here. And it looks, I can rotate it. It looks like it's got a massive big ramp on it. So let's stick the ramp to the side. Okay. Okay. It's looking it's looking funky. I've got a little ramp and I've got a computer. Right, now, what do we build? What do we build? How do we build? Why would we build? Um So we can go to craft. Now I can build I can build ooh, various things. I can build vehicles, I can build lights, I can build speed increase, I can build inventory equipment increase, and I could build a rocket. No, I can't. It's a it's a rover. I reckon I've got apart from fabric, I'm not confident on fabric. Do I have any fabric in the base? Yes, I do. Yes. Right, so I needed two rockets as well. I know I've definitely got one rocket. Have I found rockets in my? Oh, we can use um, a blueprint as well. Let's 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 treat ourselves to a uh, unlock. So, I choose you. Yes, Tech Two jetpack. That is actually handy because it means I can fly faster. Um, how do I make Tech Two jetpack? That's within parameters. I could make that. I've got a plenty. I've got plenty of that stuff. In fact, I've got some sulfur in here. What else was it? It was um, super alloy and magnesium aluminium. I'm gonna treat myself to one of these. Yeah, let's buy, let's get one of these. Because the one we've got at the moment is 150 propulsion. So if we get the new one, it's 170. Nice. So look at that now. You probably won't be able to tell any difference, but. I know I'm faster. Okay, so I need to do a rocket. What do I do to make a rocket? I need uranium, so I need two of that. I have two there. I think I'm going to be short of a rod. Um, I might struggle with this because I don't think I have any of this left. I think I have used it all. Oh, no. Yeah, I need some more. Right, I'm going to go and get some more because I do not have a clue where I've got any of that spare. So I think I'm going to have to go and mine, not mine it, I'm going to have to go and collect it from over here. So let me go and collect some. Okay, scrabbling around in the cave, I managed to get enough to do that from mining and finding some loose bits. So we need to make us a rocket now, so I need another piece of super alloy. 
We'll grab it from there. Right, so we should have two rockets now. I've also been collecting this as well once I see it, zeolite. I've not got a place to get that just yet. And I think it's probably going to be important. Okay, hopefully I've got enough now to build this. Can I build a buggy? No, I need a piece of uranium and a piece of iron. Give me some uranium. I've got a rod. Uh, okay, I have got quite a lot of that. Okay, I think that was it. Buckle. Okay. Right, so I've got a rover now. Here it is. Right, let's let's stop for a minute to admire it before the dust storm comes in and ruins my video. Okay. Now, I recently watched um, what's the film Matt Damon, uh, the Mars one. Ah, uh, I forgot what it's even called. Ooh. Um. What? So we can no. No, we can take it with us and then build it. Oh, that is good. Oh, does it have to be on a ramp to build it, though? I mean, you can drop it. Doink. Oh, it doings. Okay, so does it, does it need to charge? It doesn't replenish your energy, which is a bit... Okay, let's, let's go for a little ride. We can switch view apparently with middle mouse button. Oh, I so want to drive it in the water. Oh, we can drive underwater in it. I don't know if that's advisable. Yeah, we're not gonna keep driving underwater. I like I, I like the different camera views though. That is cool. I mean that isn't massively faster than the jetpack, but before you get the teleportation, that is a baller. And what's really cool, I've just noticed on the back of it, I've even got... Look, I've got, a, I've got a storage space on the back, so I could go on the back like this and go, what's in Shirls' chest, everyone? And then I could... Yeah, oh, that's good. Then I could, like... Yeah, let's put that away. Put that away, Shirls. All right, let's, let's, put, let's put it back up here. Now... There's upgrades. I reckon I want all these upgrades. Um, I could increase the inventory in it. I could add a rocket to it, make it faster. And I could give it lights and a beacon. I want to do all of these things. Now, is there, there's some zeolite here. Grab that. Uh, we'll grab a couple of these. We'll grab a piece of cloth, because I'm sure it wanted cloth for something. Um, was that it for upgrades? My brain has forgotten already. Right, so we need another piece of... Uh, oh, we needed uh, sulphur. Yeah. I've got a little stash of that. I have got something mining that, but I've not got a huge amount of it. But I have got a little stash there. Nice. Let us let me go and double check first, make sure I've not got any iridium. I don't think I have. Yeah, it's it's sadly the one thing I have not got a lot of at the moment. Boo! Oh, that's really upsetting. Anyway, I don't want to make the video drag on by going and seeing if I've got any in the thing, so I'm gonna do Let's give it lights. Uh, let's give it a beacon. And let's give it more storage space. Okay. And let's whip it out now. Now. Do these... Do I need to... Go in this and then add it? Or do I add the things to me? Right, so... Let's see. So what, what space have we got here now? We've got... One, two, three, four, five. So what's that? 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Right, so if I equip this. Um, no. I must have to equip it to this somehow. Right, now where do I install it? Because that packs it away. I can't see. Ooh, what is that? You what? Oh, you know what this is? This is um 
multiplayer if you've got friends and you can, yeah, ride on the back. Oh, that's cool. That is cool. What else is it? I, w I would have thought there'd be like a, a an access port or something where I stick, I stick the lights and stuff. Because it doesn't really say. It just says increase this, this size of inventory. But it doesn't tell me how to stick it in. Um... No, I don't know. Unless unless I can use it in here somehow. What are these bits? See, no, that's just... Oh, wait a minute. What's that do? Ooh! So if I click that... Oh, <laughs> that's good. That is good. Maybe I can put the bits in it while I'm on here. Oh, I really wanted to show you my lights. And I don't know how to do it. Can we do it from within here? I mean, that builds the thing, but where do we actually put it in? I'm going to feel like such a silly goose when I realise how to do this. So, if one of you, if one of you kind viewers can comment, how do I use the techers? Because normally you just drag it over there, and it's not, it's not letting me drag it. I mean, I can drag stuff off there, I guess. Yeah. But I can't install any of the vehicle techers, so I don't know why. There's no there's no computer to use. Well, th there's that computer. Doesn't seem a slot to be able to use it, though. Um, unless I'm being really, really dense. Anyway, that's all I'm going to show you for this video now. I'm going to run here before I actually suffocate. And I want to say thank you for watching. So if you are watching and you do know how to solve my predicaments, how does how does I install the technology in the buggy? Anyway, that's it for now. This is Planet Crafter. I'm Shirley Rocks. See you next time.